Hello friends, welcome back to more Finding Paradise. I am super excited to keep going. I had so much fun last time. I cannot wait to keep seeing what's happening in this game. This is so much fun. Let's see, we're just gonna explore the house now it looks like. Um, I may as well go take a gander at this person. It's not polite to stare. Sheesh, and she didn't seem to like us before. Yeah, she looks like she's sleeping pretty hard right now. Um, all right. Um, nothing over here. Anything over here? Let's look in here. Ooh, the piano. An aged digital piano. Okay, it's still the same. Dusty cello with quite a few scratches across the board. That looks the same too. Um, oh, can we not go through this door? Okay, I guess we can't. Um, but we can walk through here. Um, I bet we can't go through this door either. No, but we, I bet we can go outside. Oh, hello. Hi. Colin. Oh, <gasps> what the? This isn't a stable copy. Let's find one we can talk to. Okay, let's do that. Note, unstable copy. Interesting. I wonder what that's all about. All right. Let's pop back through here. There we go. The world has become open to us. Can't look at any of that. Let's continue through here. Um, not seeing anything available for me to look at at the moment. I bet we can go through there. Let's see, anything in here that we can interact with? Nothing that I'm seeing, so let's... Oh, nope, can't go through that door. No bathroom for us. But I have to pee. No, you don't get a bathroom. No bathroom for you. Ah, ah, ah. All right, let's head upstairs. Um, We can look at this, still full here. Ah, huh. seems like he must have cleared it very recently. Huh? This bookshelf got nothing on it now but the old the, the but one odd book when I checked and that one's not here huh we need to find Colin all right so nothing else through here I bet he's downstairs now um so let's continue on all right oh we can go outside let's go Oh, okay, no hallway. Oh no, here it is. Uh, pretty sure the hole didn't look like this. Dude's so old he can't even remember his own home. But isn't the machine supposed to autocorrect these kind of spatial inconsistencies? Well, oh hey, look. Oh, he is avoiding the question. There is something going on with him. Oh, all right. There he is. Okay. Target acquired. Let's go. Turning on entity interaction. All right. Let's head down. Hello? Colin? <gasps> Hi. My name is Dr. Ava Rosaline. I am a member. Uh, I am a memory transversal specialist at Sigmund Corp. And my colleague here is Dr. Hatton. Dr. Manhattan. Oh my God! Come on. You are Dr. Neil Watts. <gasps> How did you know? Your name tag. Ah! <laughs> this isn't what it looks to be, is it? Yes, Colin. Your procedure has started. Good. It's not just me, then. Something felt off about this place. It's as if I'm both here and far away, all at once. Either this isn't where I think I am, or my head's going downhill faster than I thought. Oh my gosh. More like both, actually. Heh, <laughs> fair enough. My wife and son, uh, how are they handling it? They're 
there, right? Yeah, but they aren't prancing around, that's for sure. Although, given the circumstances, I guess I'd be worried if they were. Listen, there's not a lot of time, and it's best if we get started. You are the most recent slice of Colin that we can load up, and the only relatively reliable version that we can interact with for info. So I hope you can assist us in completing the mission. Of course, uh, why would I not? Good. I'll keep your state saved so we won't need to have this conversation again. Psst. You want to save on his state? Yes, your highness. <laughs> now, in order to help you relive your life here to fulfill your last wish, we are first going to backtrack through your memories and connect you to your timeline. And then we'll be able to transfer your desire all the way uh, all the way to your younger self. And run the algorithm for you to live your life here all over again to fulfill your wish. Anyhow, Colin, we need your help. To jump between memories, we need mementos. They're items of importance to you that connect one memory with another. Do you have one here that we could jump with? Whoa, slow down. We still don't even know what his wish is. What is that you want anyway, Colin? What do you want? Actually, I think I can answer both of your questions with this. What is it? What do you want? It's his Sigmund contract. The text is rather blurry, but... Memento detected? It is a memento. Sweet! Let's move! What? This memento's barrier shatters by itself since it's so recent, but the next one won't be so easy. Okay. Oh my god, wait. Can I interact with this other door? Oh my god. I can't. Aw, oh, dang. I wanted to see that guy again. <laughs> that was one of my most favorite things so far. Okay. So we got that memento. Now I guess we're moving on. What? Is it locked? Okay, I must have messed something up. Oh, I can interact with him. We'll need to charge it up first. Memento. Oh, here we go. It's time to go. Prepare. Okay, ooh, is this a new mini game? Memories go the farthest when linked together. Oh, okay, so it's just, is this the same as last time? It's been so long since I played. Okay, um. Oh. Okay, I see. All right, I hope that was the way I was supposed to do that. Fingers crossed anyway. Okay. Activate memento, activate. Thanks, we may, might come back for your help again. Okay. Cheers, my friends. How did he know that was gonna be a memento? This is so interesting. Guys, I'm love I think I love it. I think I'm enjoying this game even more than the first one, honestly. Wait a minute, this place. It's a this is a really good sequel. I'm like I'm very impressed right now. Okay. It's the Sigmund guest house. Ah, where they wine and dine the geezers into signing up for the service. Sure been a while since I visited. Looks a bit different from when I was last here, too. Let's check it out. Okay, so we need to find three mementos. Cool. And it's Dr. Watts who's in charge. Um, I'm just looking around, seeing if I can uh, interact with anything. Okay, I don't think there's anything out here. So let's keep moving. Maybe exploring the grounds a bit? No, it doesn't look like there's anything over there. 
Let's check over to this side. Oh, there's something. Hello? What are you doing outside in the cold, Mr. Reeds? Your appointment is about ready. Please, right this way. Oh, a memento. Or an orb. Or something. Whatever they're called. Okay, ooh. Let's continue on in, I guess. Okay. Another ghost person. Hello, ghost person. Can I talk to you, ghost person? I need to probably be closer. Oh, it gave me the... Oh, there, there we go. What? There we go. There we go. There we go. Finally. Welcome to the Sigmund Corp guest house. Please have a seat in our living room. Okay. Are we good to go? Why don't you sit back and enjoy some tea first? You must have come a long way to get here. They mentioned tea in my game. I have to take a sip of tea here. Well, it's coffee right now, but still. Tea time! I need to get home back home soon. I'd just like to inquire about your service. Uh, very well. Someone will be here to get you shortly. Okay. I need to get back home soon. I'm sure you do. There's so much to the world, isn't there? Much more than one could explore in a single lifetime. Say, wouldn't it be nice to visit where you've always wanted to go? Huh. I've already been there. Once upon a time. Oh. Okay. Here's the fireplace. I don't recall the fireplace here looking like that. Really? Interesting. Okay. I bet we can continue on. I see an arrow. This photo is taken from the stage's perspective. Exhilarating, huh? Not many people get to experience what it's like to be famous. We sure get a lot of requests for that. So if it floats your boat, consider it done. If we have to do another one of these, I'm going to... Oh, sorry, this is Dr. Watts, not Colin. If we, if we have to do another one of these, I'm going to take go take a nap. It's not so bad. At least we'd get it done fast and go home early. <laughs> if you'd like to choose fame and riches for your last witch, consider it done. I don't think that's what he wants, though. I have a feeling it has to do with the bird... I love my bird. It is the best, most awesome bird. Okay. You see, our service is really quite simple. You tell us your wish and we make it happen. Fame, wealth, unreached goals, and secret desires. You name it. We're your genie, Colin. What is your wish? So, if I understand this correctly... You're saying I can't wish for more wishes. <laughs> Colin. <laughs> I can't. That was great. You know, I've done and seen a lot in my lifetime. I've been to where I once thought I'd never be. Seen what I once thought I'd never see. But in the blink of an eye, suddenly there's no more time. And I find myself here. Just like everyone else. I walk through these doors and I realize that there's still this empty feeling inside me. I don't mean to be ungrateful to the life I've had, but... I just want to feel like I've done enough in this world before I go, you know? I want to say I've lived a happy life, and I want to feel like I have few regrets. But somehow, after all that, I still can't. That's why we are here, Colin. Just give us the word and we'll make it right. Tell us your regrets. What is it that you want us to fix? Regrets. I don't know what to tell you for regrets, but I can tell you what I want. I want you to make me live that fulfilling life I wanted. But I want you to do it without changing anything I've been through. You don't want us to change anything? Colin, changing things is what we do. 
We change things and we make them better. That's why you come to us, so we can make it better. We can solve your problems. Everything you wanted but couldn't have in this life, we can give you the chance to get it. But if you want to get something, you need to give up something. So I ask again, what do you want as your last wish? Very well. I want you to give me a fulfilling life while changing as little as possible. And if you have to change something, please just keep the memories of the life with my family intact. So you want to waive specificity from the contract. With something like that, I hope you know there are no guarantees of result. I'm aware. It's settled then. I'll put our best people on it. Thank you. That's all I ask. Received note, Colin's wish. Try not to change anything. And we have free reign over his fate. What kind of a last wish is that? I don't even know where to start. And well, we've seen worse. The important thing here is that the boss said we'll put our best people on it. We're their best people, Ava. Ha! Booyah! <laughs> Actually, about that... Never mind. <laughs> okay, I'm good. Let's go get the memento. Alright, uh, where's the memento? Oops. Think we should go back to the last memory and ask Colin about what he said here? Can't really expect a reliable answer from that, but we might eventually have to try. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it, though. Let's just continue on for now. No, mon no wonder this was a memento. Or, this was... No wonder the contract was a memento. What a waste, just sitting here looking pretty. Huh. Okay, I guess that's not it. Best docs in the house. Booyah! You picked the right people for the job. Oh, <laughs> Ava's just like, about that. We aren't exactly... Oh, just one more thing. Please don't tell my family. I don't want them to think I'm not content with how things are. Aww. All right. If you'd like to choose fame or riches, okay, consider it done. I don't recall the fireplace here looking like that. Okay, it wasn't that. Maybe it's outside? I don't see anything that looks like a memento. It doesn't budge. That's odd. Okay, uh, mm. Oops. I don't quite remember how this kind of stuff works. Oh, wait, is that it? Yeah, we found it. You know, I've been rather impressed. What for? Well, back in the days, you kept on yelling dumb juveniles, <laughs> juvenilities while shooting the barriers. But recently, I haven't heard any ha Haduken or Kamehameha or whatnot. It's been rather pleasant and, and professional. Oh, mm-hmm. Yeah, what's going on with Dr. Watts? There is something going on with him. Let's prepare this memento, shall we? All right. Oh, okay. So this is going to be kind of like, um, kind of like a, a candy crush situation. Okay. Um, yeah. Boom. Oh, it's a hat. All right. Um, I need to get back home soon. Yes, you do. Nope. Nope, stop it. Here we go. Activate memento. Activate it. Yeah! We're gonna go back in time. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Here we are. I'd better head out now before I forget. Here, take this hat, Pops. With the headache you've been getting, you should be more careful of the wind. 
Oh, he's getting headaches. I've been telling him that for ages. He never listens. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll wear it if it stops this multi-directional nagging. <laughs> hey, it's been a while since your thing with Pam didn't work out. Listen, I was talking with my old colleague the other day. He's got a daughter named Jenny, you see. She's single and... Look, thanks, but I, I just really need to focus on my career right now. So, you guys gonna go back to feeding the ducks or something? We wouldn't have to resort to that if you visited us more often, you little bastard. <laughs> Aw, but that hat is 100% cotton. Well, alright, you're off the hook. <laughs> Drive safe, dear. We'll stay here and keep being overlord of the ducks. Bye, Ma. I'm proud of you. Not for the duck thing, but like, you know what I mean. <laughs> Don't stay out too long this time of year. Okay. Aww. Off we go. That kid's need that kid needs to make us a grandchild. What's wrong with Jenny anyway? Probably nothing, but you know how it is. When you were young, didn't your parents try to push people onto you too? Sure did. It was awkward and forced. Mmm, sucked all the chemistry out of it for me as well. Uh -huh. What are you doing? I'm texting him Jenny's info to set them up. Don't do that! He's driving. Do it after he gets home. <laughs> good call. Make sure to include some pictures, too. Aw, the good ones with lighting coming from the side. Aww. No words. <laughs> That's adorable. No regret. No grandkids. Okay, he wanted grandkids. That's the regret he has. Send the pics with no duck face. <laughs> yup. Oh, that's adorable. Okay, let's try talking to her. Oh, wait, we already did this. Okay. Oh, crap. I missed it. Eyebrows. Send the pics where the chin is down. Hmm. Oh, she's just gonna keep... Don't send the ones with the duck face. You said that already. Oh, don't send the ones with the duck face. You said that. I missed the, the eyebrows. I thought they were going to be saying the same thing again. Why? I'm mad. It's okay. Just going to look around. See if I can see any things. Looking, looking, looking. Let's just keep on looking. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah. All right. Do I see anything? Oh, hi. Overlord of the ducks. Doesn't look like I can, I can interact with you at all, though. Oh, but I can interact with... Oh, there we go. Oof. I'm gonna sneeze in a second, friends. Are you serious? One for each duck. I'm not complaining. Wish there were a whole flock. No ducks. Ah, my sneeze might have disappeared. I'm not sure. We'll see, guys. I'll keep you updated. On the sneeze situation. <laughs> I'm sure everyone's on pins and needles. Edge of your seat. The suspense is killing you. Will she sneeze or will she not? <laughs> All right, let's see. Hello. My granddaughter turns five this year. Can you believe it? She's growing big so fast. I'm thinking of making my knitting modular. Time really flies, huh? No kidding. I didn't even realize how old I was getting till I broke my other hip. <laughs> Word of advice. Don't go breaking your hip. Don't go breaking your hip. I couldn't if I tried. <laughs> yeah, I've been lucky on that front so far. Seriously, I shouldn't even be out right now. Uh, why are you out right now? It's like just a bag of loose bones rattling around in there. <laughs> I tell you. Just clanging and clunging and clunging and clanging. How are you even standing up? Oh, okay. One more to go. Um, looks like there's nothing else over here. Can I go inside? Is that a thing? No. Okay. I, I, I'm finding myself getting stuck in the old voice. Oh, there she is. 
Overlord of the Ducks. Can we go sit down? <gasps> What's this? Their call card. I, I printed out another. Sigmund Corp. Ugh. What made you change your mind? I still feel the same way about it. But some days I wake up and see you on the balcony looking out like that and... You don't say it, but I know there's something that still aches you. Tell me, are, are you happy? Of course I am. I have you and Asher. Then why do you want to go through with their services? Just because I'm happy doesn't mean I don't have regrets. Not that I'd be it'd be related to you too anyhow. Call them. But when you go through the procedure and live that new life, just hold on to something from here. It's not like that, Fia. I won't forget about you. Oh. Don't make me cry! Hey. Hmm. I think I forgot to bring duck food. <laughs> huh. Me too. The ducks are gonna be mad! They're gonna be so mad at you. Oh my god. Well. <laughs> well, that explains the attitude. Oh my god, I'm crying. I literally just did my makeup. I'm mad at you, game! I told you there was something up with her. You know, she could always sign up with Sig Corp for a life where Colin never signed up with Sig Corp. <laughs> ha ha. All right. Oh, man. I just, oh, man, the idea of, like, being a spouse who has to, like, watch your, like, know that not only are you losing your spouse, but they may lose all their memories of you. Like, that is, that is rough.com. Oh, there it is. Memento detected. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh. Let's prepare this memento, shall we? Man, that... It just hurts my heart. Okay, so we're gonna move this up. We're gonna move this... Over... Wow, a lot of these mementos have had to do with Sigcorp. All right, let's go. Let's activate it. Oh, what the? Did he go without? Whoa, what is that? What? Can I follow him? There is something screwy going on. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Okay. What took you so long? I... I thought I saw someone weird back there. Huh? Did you say that to their face and hurt their feelings? <laughs> uh, weird as in they were watching from the woods. Watching from the woods. Yeah, and when I looked, it almost seemed like they... Ugh. Oh, never mind, it's stupid. Okay, Ava, be honest now. Have you been reading too much dusk light? I already said never mind. They were static anyway, so it was no one important. Huh. Well, uh, you'll be happy to hear that while you were staring at nothing, I have scouted this memory out. Wait, what? I was only behind you by a few seconds. Ha! Nice try, Slowpoke. Anyhow, here's what's going on here. In the kitchen, they have a fight about what we suspect from the last memory. Bam. After that, they make up and play music over there. QR, etc., etc. Oh, and then Colin goes to sulk on the balcony. The end. Dude, spoilers. 
aren't always a bad thing when we're on the job. <laughs> but here, I even picked up a memory link for you to, uh, to make up for it. And if you want to see everything yourself so much, then just don't use my unlocks. Okay. Huh. Oh. Oh, required. Okay. Can I go out here? Okay. Oh, this looks familiar. Memento detected. There's the memento. Is the phone. Well, that's good. Um, doesn't look like... Oh, I can look at him. Okay. What's going on with you, buddy? Oh! Okay. I'm not going for you. I should have gone to the kitchen first now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, listen to that beautiful music. Wow. Okay, before I keep going, I'm gonna go back to the kitchen and try to pick up whatever fight they had down there. Listen to the beautiful music. Okay, let's go watch the fight. I don't understand. Why would you even consider? Why would you toss aside everything we have for something make-believe? I'm not tossing anything aside. I mean, don't you have regrets too? Yes, but I actually have respect for what I've been through here what we've been through here. Tell me, what do you want to change? I want, I mean. There are so many little things that could have just been better. Better. And if you call Sigmund, what would you ask for? I, I don't know what to tell you, Fia. And the least you could have done is to make up something nice, isn't it? Oh. Remember, Colin is our client. Everything else is fluff. I know. Oh. Oof. Man. Oh, it makes me sad. All right, and we went through here. Let's talk to them. It's rather ghostly when the audio and visuals don't quite sync up. Oh my God. <laughs> Called out. Okay. But I'm still missing one. He goes out to sulk outside. Okay, what else? There's got to be something else around. So let's just walk through and see if we see anything we can interact with. Um, we can talk about the audio and visuals again. This is the bathroom, but I don't think it's going to allow me to go through there. So I may as well go back downstairs because maybe now that I've gotten all three, there, something will change. Or I could try to go upstairs. I'm not sure if the, the staircase will be back yet. Oh, here. There's something here. We all have regrets, be it writing or wrong or a dream, dream long past, or perhaps that one special someone. 
If you've got to do it all over again, who would you be? Where would you go? At Sigmund Corp, we give you that second chance to make things go right. Because with our help, it's never too late. Well, I'm glad they've made better slogans since then. <laughs> oh no. Oh my goodness. I like like I said, I can 100% understand why Fia would have such such reservations about her husband going through with this. I mean, they've had this love story forever. They've got this their wedding photo above the TV. And yet he still has regrets about his life, like this life that they've shared. Let's prepare this memento, shall we? How awful to think that it would... Oh, look. Okay, so I can't change any of that. Okay. Um... Great. Boom. I'm learning. All right, uh, let's head in. Activate this memento, thank you. Cell phone as memento. <gasps> oh my God, all the way back to here? Wow. Wait, how in the world? I feel you, Ro I feel you, Ava. Wow! Oh my god! Childhood. Did we just skip his whole life? I don't know how this could have happened. But since we're here already, try transferring this his signal from the last memory. Roger. Okay, so it doesn't work. Nope, not working. We might have leaped all the way, but the middle of the path is still uncleared. Then, what now? Are, are we stuck here? Eh, beats me. We're already here, though, so might as well look around. Hmm. Receive note anomaly. Like I said, there is something weird going on here. There is some weird shit. There's some weird shit going on. I'm locked. I have to jump. Huh? <laughs> the book was what catapulted. Oh, it was a book, not a cell phone. Oh my god, I'm such a dummy. The book was what catapulted us all the way here, right? How very magical and equally annoying. <laughs> hey. Hmm? This book, it's not getting wet from the rain. Huh. I guess it glitches in more ways than one. What a spooky kid. Okay, I'm not seeing anything else I can interact with. But it's 100% clear that this is definitely the kid from a bird story. Because this is his house. Oh my god. Requires five to proceed. Okay. I guess we need to keep heading. I don't see anything else in this room I can interact with. Oh my God, I'm getting such nostalgia. You hang in there, son. Food's in the fridge as always. Uh, keep this place in check, all right? I will. I'm sorry we have to leave again, Colin. But at least we got to see you today before we go. I understand you need to work hard to keep us afloat. That's right. If it's, it's a difficult time, but we'll get through it. And one day, things are going to be all better. We'll make sure of that. Mm. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you should keep eating more, you little scamp. Those breads were going quick for a while. I thought you hit a growth spurt. <laughs> Take care, son. 
Oh, because of the bird. Okay, so this is happening after a bird story. Bye, Dad. Okay, we got one. Oh. And now, back to Rudog the Red-Nosed Corgi. <laughs> hey, look, you're in TV. Say something. That's not how I remember the show goes at all. Oh, Rudog. <laughs> Received note. Okay, anything else? Oh, I can look at the TV. Oh, it's the same thing. Okay. And I can't click on him to make him change. Oh, look, there's, there's a version of him over here. <gasps> Aww. Come on, Rude Dog, you can jump too. Aww, that's adorable. A plushie with a red, oh, it's a plushie. Okay, I can look at this stuff. A jar of loose change. Okay. Anything else? Nope, okay. Let's go check the bathroom and then we can head back upstairs. Maybe there'll be something new and different. Hmm. I don't see anything to interact with in here. I guess let's head up. Oh, oh, did I see anything else? No, just looking at the TV. Okay, let's head back up. Oh, oh! Vroom, vroom! Oh! Oh, he fell. He fell! Is he dead? If he's dead, how could we be here decades later? Maybe it's his twin. Oh my god. Dude, too soon. Well, I actually, I guess it's been a while. A long while. But still, not cool. Eh. <laughs> oh god, yeah, really not cool. Is he asleep? Did he fall asleep there? Okay, well, we got all, all five things. Although, wait, it's giving me the option to go out, so I, I should check on it. No, okay, it won't let me through. <laughs> okay, well, let's head up then. All right. <gasps> okay. Oh, he's making the paper airplanes with that. Memento detected. What the? Isn't this already the furthest memory back? Yeah. Uh, huh. Am I going to start going forward now? Are we going forward in time? Wait, I just realized something. Hum? A few memories ago at the Sigmund signing house. Ugh, here we go. And the boss said he put his best people on this case. This was like ages ago, Neil. But he didn't actually mean us, did he? Because Colin was originally assigned to Roxanne and frickin' Rob. Yeah, let it go, man. That is utter bull... Okay, calm down. No, I am rage. What? Ah! <laughs> Kame! Kame! Don't interrupt me. Ha! Duke! <laughs> wow, you've really moved up to getting sued by two IPs simultaneously. Sorry, Ava. I just can't have you go on thinking I've gotten tame. You could say you brought that upon yourself. No, Neil. I really wouldn't say that. <laughs> that was great. All right, let's prepare this memento, shall we? Let's do it. All right, all right. So I can't move this one. Okay, I see what I see what to do. Crap, I could have done that better, but there we go. There's that one. Oh, nice. That's all I all I had to do. Okay. Uh, let's head. Activate this memento. 
All right, let's see where this goes. Where are we going? Let's go. Let's go. Oh, a ghost person. Oh, we're flying. I'm leaving on a jet plane. And we're back to old age. Whoa. Atlantis, uh, Atlanta Center, Cactus 135, cruising flight level 360. Cactus 135, Atlanta Center, Roger. Altimeter setting 3017. Have a good flight. Altimeter 3015. Thank you, Cactus 135. Well, we've got a nice tailwind going for us. Sir, now that we're in cruise, I just wanted to ask. I just wanted to say, it's an honor to be here as your first officer on your final flight. This may be my first time as first officer, but I won't let you down. Eh, <laughs> it's all good. Rather poetic, really. Passing the baton and all. But you should know. As my co-pilot, there's only two things I really ever want to hear from you. Two things, sir. Yep. There, yes, Captain. And landing gear down. <laughs> You're funny, sir. What did I just say? Oh, really? He doesn't want to talk? Uh, yes, Captain. Ha, of course, I'm just messing with you. Just reminded me of back when I did my first flight as first officer, that's all. Man, my captain then was a crazy mess. <laughs> yes, Captain. Hmm, you know I just said I was kidding, right? Yes, Captain? Okay. Hey. I'm gonna let my wife and son come in and sit for a bit, if you don't mind. It's my last flight, after all. They're not gonna get this view again. Yes, Captain. <laughs> Please tell me he's just messing with it. Uh, Irene, could you bring my family in? Thank you. All right, um, here we go. Anything to look at in here? Oh, what's this? Uh, flight regulations were still so chill back in the day, huh? Eh, times change. Really? Okay, so is, is this a long time ago? Um, can't talk to him. Great, so let's head back. Oh. That, there's Irene and the family. So what do you two say? What do you two say? One last round. Is it all right with management? Already approved, special occasion and all. You heard him, Ma. Go, go, go. All right, let's let's head. Can I can I get back through? There we go. Let's go. Sorry, this this uh, plane is confusing me. Oh, it was a chair. So you're gonna miss the views. From the big birds? Uh, sure. But it's not like I'm giving up the sky. Oh, don't you go renting those small planes. I don't trust you flying in them. Speaking of, I wish they gave you a bigger plane for the last flight of your career. Like one of those monster double-deckers. Ha. Huh. I asked for this one, this particular one myself. I had my first flight with the airline in this. It was a different time back then. A little while with lots of peanuts. A time with lots of peanuts. Sorry, guys. Oof. I miss them so much. You know, Dad, all these years of flying and you never told me why you chose to be a pilot in the first place. Oh, I haven't, huh? Psst. Don't tell your mother, but it was to impress a girl. Yeah? D did it work? Sure, I guess. Oh, please. With the way your father acted, I doubt he dated anyone at all when we met. Shots fired, Dad. Hey now, Fia, don't go spreading false rumors in front of our son. I'll have you know I, that I was quite the stud back in the days. Uh, Captain, just a reminder that we're on the record for the black box. Oh, thanks for the reminder. Let the record show that my biceps are out of this world. <laughs> No, no, they really aren't. 
<laughs> oh, but they are. <laughs> when I pulled that yoke on takeoff earlier, I practically lifted the entire plane off the ground. Isn't that right, Peyton? Yes, Captain. Yeah? Well, let me tell y'all a story about this one time and involving a jar of pickles. Okay, we need to maintain a sterile cockpit for landing. Let's get you two back to your seats. Ha <laughs> ha! Off you go now, shoo shoo. <laughs> Sir, we're not landing for another couple of hours. I know. Aww, you just couldn't have that story be on the record. <laughs> Whistling as he's flying the plane. So, uh, are you coming with or not? Nah, I like this view. I thought you were, um, ac acrophobic. I don't think, I, I don't know that one. Only when I'm not inside a plane. Afraid of heights, yeah? How about you go wrap up this memory and I'll join you shortly after? Are you serious? It's on a loop. Yeah, but the picture from this seat's angle is just absolutely divine. In fact, I pity you or anyone who can't see the way the horizon meets the... Don't give me that... Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, ooh. What? Oh, oh my God, we're on the ground. I was like, what is happening? Thank you for the lovely flight, sir. Cheers, hope you have a nice day. Hello, little one. I hope you enjoyed the, the landing sucked. Uh, yeah, sorry, it was a little rough. Not one of my better landings. The wind was, aw, huh? No, regret, bad landing. Okay, so his last flight had a bad landing. Okay, okay, I, I see. Anything else here? Okay. Oh. Oh, a fellow cellist, huh? Here, let me get that for you. Aw. Thank you, sir. Yay, are you good at the cello? <laughs> Not really. My wife is the real musician of the family. Beautiful instrument, though. I loved playing it as a kid. No, cello. Aww. I knew that was going to be the memento. Beautiful instrument, though. Can I talk to anyone else? No? Okay, just time for the memento. Boom! Let's get it. Yeah! Yeah! All right, now we're gonna grab this cello. Let's prepare this uh, memento. Okay. Got it. Oh, okay, good. I was like, is that, do I have more to do? Cello, cello. Let's activate it. Let's go. Sup? Dude, I was just about to. Off we go into the wild blue yonder. All right. Oh, now we're a kid again. Wow, we are experiencing this quite strangely. Uh, how did we skip to the childhood memories again? And this time the memento isn't even that book. Is there something wrong with the machine, Neil? Huh? Uh, it's not the machine. At least uh, I don't think it is. Well, I guess at least we know that we can go back now. Let's just hope this doesn't interfere with finishing this job. Relax, we'll manage. This is fascinating. Is there literally anything else left, Miss Miller? Nope. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> this is your instrument. Get used to it. <laughs> oh, you didn't like it at first. Loved playing cello as a kid, my ass. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Wow, you belong at a grade school. Your childish jabs aside, Ava, and on an unrelated note. Unrelated note. This place kind of makes me feel like I'm on the set of some indie French film. Uh, what? What about this possibly makes you feel that way? I don't know. Just a feeling. Oh my god. And so we're going to have French music. <laughs> I'm obsessed. This is great. Okay, can I... Will, will anything happen if I talk to them again? If you wanted something else, you should have lined up earlier. 
Honestly, I hear that. What about, what about if I talk again? Okay, it's just the same. Um, great, let's continue. Oh, I remember this so clearly. Hey, don't push. I call dibs on the violin, it's so light to carry. I'm gonna get the flute, it fits in my backpack. Oh, him with his giant cello. Tiny child giant cello. That's hilarious. Okay, well, let's head this way and look at this one. What's he doing? Counting dirt, I guess. Okay, well, before I go in there, let's keep going and see what else there is in here. Oh, I remember this so vividly. Did you see that? Is he carrying that thing or is it carrying him? Looks like just a floating case from behind. Rude. That's so rude. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is so crazy because I just remember it so vividly from a bird story. I guess it wasn't that recently that I played it, but it's still, it feels like just a little, like, I feel like I just played it and I'm back. It's so wonderful, actually. It's like, got, get, it's giving me the feeling of nostalgia. Okay, requires three to proceed. There we go. I should have just checked earlier, but I didn't because I'm uh, crazy. <laughs> All right. Um, well, I can look at these. Huh, I have a feeling these aren't exact replicas from the actual setting. It's as if his memories took quite the creative liberty in mixing things up. Isn't the machine built with public domain data stabilizers to prevent this? Uh, yeah, but uh, maybe broken? Maybe. You're the tech specialist. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll have a look afterward. There's something weird going on. La, 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 la. There's something weird going on and we're gonna figure it out. Yeah! Okay. Oh. Oh, 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 okay. I can't actually talk to these people. The shadow people! Wow, this is awkward to watch. Ava, why do we get all these losers as our clients? Maybe because you're here, moron. Aw, oh, well, that's a nice compliment for under Gauss's law for magnetism. Oh my gosh, what's that? Okay, huh? Let's leave him alone. Oh wait, he already is. <laughs> all right, well, uh, let's keep moving, I guess. That door said it needed three to proceed, but I just want to double check that there's nothing else I can do here, okay. I don't see anything else, so we'll just continue on. Head through that other door. Keep it moving, as it were. Boom, let's go, let's go. Boom shakalaka, walkin' a waka. <laughs> what was that? I have no idea. All right, going through the door. Aw. Colin. Colin! Uh, the answer is C. What? I'll ask you again. What is the radius of this circle? Uh, where's your head out, Colin? Go stand out in the hall. Aww. Okay. What's up, lady? Go stand out in the hall. Okay, I will. Okay, I will. I'm going out to stand in the hall. Hmm. I think I saw something on the wall back there. Head out anyway? Stay. Something on the wall? Oh! Thank you, Rose. Thank you, Ava. Huh. This could be our ticket out of here. All right. I think we could just reach it if we... Nah, I got this. Let me find a way. Let me find a way to get to it. All right, now watch this. Is that a freaking wand? Wait, you didn't disable the... Mobilaribus uh, teacher's deskus. <laughs> oh my 
my gosh, oh my gosh! And down. Did you kids just flip and see that? Dude. Reset. Okay, first of all, disable reactive interactivity before you pull that stuff. And second of all, that's not even how the spell goes. Uh, yeah it is. Did you see that thing flying? They sure did, you village idiot. Alright, uh. Go stand out in the hall. Okay. There we go. We found our memento. Woohoo! Huh. What? Nothing. I guess I was expecting you to start saying dumb things again. Ava, do you know how draining it is to unleash a Kamehameha and a Hadouken simultaneously? I mean, I know I'm a pro, but even I need my beauty, beauty sleep. Oh my god. Alright, let's prepare this memento. Let's do it. I like this new mini game. Okay, so we need the clock. Um... Oh, okay, so I can't move this or that. Okay. That sure makes this interesting. Okay, so um, I can move this. Oh, great. That was easy. Um, I can move this too and get a, a five. There we go. Hell yeah! I missed my calling as a candy crush master! Alright, this seems like a good spot for us to save and quit for today um, before I head into the next memory. And so I will do that. I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am. I'm loving this game like so much. Um, and I cannot wait to see you all next time. Bye!